So Tim and I's wedding is just around the corner and even thinking about it makes me so nervous guys. And I hear it's also wedding season as well. So here is a very cute and different bride and groom nail design for your big day engagement party or maybe even your bachelorette party. Look, it's me and Tim. And even if you're not getting hitched anytime soon, that's totally cool. Maybe you can share it with a friend who is. Let's start. First step, apply a base coat to prevent your nails from staining. And then with a white nail polish, apply this only in your middle fingernail. While letting the white polish dry off, I'm taking a silver pearly color and applying this to all of my fingernails except my ring finger. Going back to my white polish, I'm going to be working on the ring finger. And as you can see, I'm just using my brush and I'm creating a sweetheart neckline of a wedding dress. Coating the fleshy part of my nail with a clear nail polish, I then add some little gems so it looks like a necklace and also helps it appear more three-dimensional as well. Dripping some white nail polish on a surface and using a toothpick, I'm just going to make little dashes along the neckline so it just gives the dress more detail and not as uh, flat. To make the dress appear more three-dimensional, I'm applying a pearly color on top of it just to give it a bit more glam. Then using a white polish, I just coat this on top of the gem so it looks more like a pearl necklace rather than a diamond necklace. Now I'm taking a glitzy glitter polish and I'm going to be applying this to my silver nails but only in the nail tips so it creates a gradient effect. Every girl likes a bit of sparkle, you know what I'm saying? Coating the nail with a clear polish, add 2-3 to three gems to give it a little bit more bling bling. Now let's suit up one of the nails with a tux. Take a piece of tape and then cut it so it's at a right angle and then position this over your nail to form a stencil. Make sure the tip fits nice and snug, then apply a coat of black polish. While it's still wet, peel this tape. To make the bow and buttons, just drip some black polish and use your toothpick to draw two little triangles for the bow. Now I add two dots for the buttons. Now this step is optional but I just wanted to make more 3D so I'm adding a gem right in the center of the bow and for it to match the bride more, I'm going to paint the center also white. Last step, seal with a top coat so it lasts and lasts and lasts, so it's bulletproof. Voila! Now my bride and groom nails are complete. I'll let you in a secret, it was super easy to do but also very very fun. All you needed was nail polishes, tip pick, and some gems. I hope you guys enjoyed this nail tutorial. Thank you so much for watching, and I shall talk to you soon. Take care, everybody. Mwah.